Be that out. was so awesome. Uh, how fit must the gents be to be able that is high energy, awesome mastery of their craft. We absolutely love it, man. Yeah, Thank yeah, you they'll, so much they'll, 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 they have more uh, performances coming your way. But right now, a moment for us to quickly update you on the latest news from uh, the world of technology. Yeah. Um, now, you may have heard of the Flying V guitar <laughs> that was uh, synonymous with 80s heavy metal bands. But what about a literal Flying V? Well, a team of researchers at the Delft University <laughs> in the Netherlands <laughs> <laughs> have come up with a new aircraft design that they claim will save 20% on fuel costs. Now, instead of the traditional central fuselage with wings extending from each side, the Flying V is made up of two shafts that extend diagonally from uh, the front in a V shape. And these two shaped sections will then form both wings and the cabins where passengers sit. What? Look at this. What? Uh I'm trying to wrap my mind around that. So the team is hoping to do a test flight with a scale model later this year, but it could still be another 20 to 30 years before something like this actually becomes a commercial viability or reality, but still. Yeah, I mean, no, but look, we, we say that now, but when we think about the biggest issue we have with carbon footprint at the moment is the amount, is the fuel that is spent on planes to transport stuff. For fuel. It's a massive thing, and it looks pretty funky as well. It does, it does. It feels like really it'll, cool, it'll, it'll get you there faster too. Always moving forward. And you know what direction you're going in as well, cool which stuff. is cool. Um, okay, so this one is pretty cool. Um, uh, completely on the different end of the scale, Uber Australia has launched a pretty fun new service in aid of conservation. We love the sound of that. It's called Scuba. Scuba. You, you, you gotta say scuba. 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 Um, and it's exactly what you think it is. Until the 18th of June, uh, Uber users in Queensland can enjoy a submarine ride through the Great Barrier Reef, one of <gasps> the most breathtakingly beautiful things on our planet. And they're able to order directly from their Uber app. Wait, wait. Boom! So you can go and just do that and, and see, <laughs> see um, one of the modern kind of, I think, wonders of the world. The campaign has been put together in collaboration with the Queensland uh, Tourist Board. All the proceeds are donated to an NGO called Citizens of the Great Barrier Reef, and they need to protect it because it is under attack. When you think about oceans being this kind of battle line that's been drawn in conservancy, the Great Barrier Reef is a, a litmus test to see where the ocean no is. No way. And that is just so cool. There we go. Which Scuba. You do that? Does that freak you out, being in a, in a, a small, confined space? The I'm okay with that. Really? As long as I know that I can breathe the air around there and it's 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 super. And you scuba. can swipe for it. It's charged straight to your credit card. It's you don't even need to swipe for it. You just <laughs> click and then five star rating. Wait, the, now the question is, is somebody else <laughs> driving the scuba? Or do you, is it, is, it auto, is it autonomous? Uh, no, it's better be a driver. I am yeah. getting in, the, in no <laughs> scuba with no driver. Uh, uh, so cool. Uh, very cool, man. Let that's, us know what you think about those stories and also tell us about the stories that have caught your attention uh, in the world of technology and other Otherwise, of course, if you're looking for the latest, check out our website, expressoshow.com. And the technology tab will have all those stories for you there.